Wishing you a fantastic Friday morning. Prepared to be amazed and astonished with the magic of David Johnson, specifically close-up magic. Uh, David has introduced Kingston to the Kingston Magic Theater. Uh, we're like Vegas now. Yeah. Really, we are. That's uh, so cool. It, it, it is cool because I like to believe that everybody absolutely loves magic. I know I yeah. do. Me too. Me too. It's an amazing thing. Because magic is that opportunity to witness and experience something that elicits an emotion um, where even if an explanation was available, it, it doesn't matter because you witnessed that yourself. See, as an audience member, half of me wants to know how it's done. The other half doesn't want to know because I don't want to have it ruined. No, and I think that's absolutely okay. That's how I got interested in magic, and I think that to have that curiosity sparked is you know, one of the things that I aim to achieve because if magic were real, I wouldn't have a day job. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. Um, it's interesting in that uh, you do close-up magic. There are different kinds of magic out there. You do close-up magic. Explain this and in the context of the Kingston Magic Theatre Club. I think that close-up magic is the purest form of entertainment because it happens in your hands. It's that moment where you are actively involved inches away from the effect that's happening. and uh, No strings, no trap doors. There's no smoke, no mirrors, no big boxes. When you rely heavily on that immediate entertainment, I think that's what it's all about. Well, let's talk about some gigs coming up at the Kingston at Magic Theatre. Yes. Uh, you have two specifically coming up next weekend. That's exactly right. On the 17th of January, uh, we're premiering the brand new stand-up show, Slightly Off the Wall. This is 75 minutes of, of pure, incredible chaos and entertainment. Uh, following that, we're going to uh, have a command performance on Sunday, January 19th of our flagship program, Astonishment and Wonder. This is, uh, this is a, they're both fantastic shows. You know what, I love to be astonished, I love to be in wonderment. Uh, can you uh, do maybe some illusions, some oh. close-up magic for us right now? <laughs> and stick around because we'll have more with David a little bit after the top of the hour. I'm so glad that you asked, Bill. Uh, I love magic. Yeah, this is amazing. Uh, this is the bag of astonishment and wonder. And I don't need these anymore. Just no, yeah. no tricks here, <laughs> I'm just gonna. Okay. This, my friend, is the bag of astonishment and wonder. What's inside is most <laughs> important. <laughs> All right. Yeah. There's a little red ball that lives inside this cup, and I'll show the audience that the cup is empty. Yeah. Could I get you to examine that? It's hard. It is hard. It doesn't squish. It doesn't squish at all. Here's what we're going to do. In a moment, Bill, I'm going to take that ball, and I'm going to place it underneath the cup. Okay. But before I do that, I need to do this. Did you see it? Did you s Oh, this is it. Damn. You know what happens? The ball appears in my pocket. But if I put it back in my pocket, I snap my fingers, now it appears inside the, the cup. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing if you think about it. Here's what we'll do. I'll shake it up, I'll take the ball, I'll place it back in my pocket. You can see that the ball is in my pocket, yeah. not inside the cup. Not but in your hand. If I snap my fingers, just like that, the ball actually travels back underneath the cup. Pretty impressive, isn't it? But I think that's, uh, I think that's almost impossible because- This is not magic, this is this physics. Is, this is it is quantum, physics. quantum physics. Quantum here. physics. And that was pretty impressive because if you think that that ball was in the cup and that line was in the cup, check this out. <laughs> Where did that come from? Wait, that's a great question. <laughs> Probably the one I asked the very first time I saw it. But if you uh. thought that was impressive and amazing, you're going to think that this, my friend, is just nuts. Where did that walnut come from? Yeah. How do you get it all in there? That, that's a great question. It's empty. Yeah, it is. Uh, you know, the secret to this and every effect that I perform, you can learn from the pages of a book. Yeah, it's true. I don't want to do the reading. I just want to be in the audience entertained. In the, yes, man. Yeah. Yes. Is that amazing? I love that. I think it's incredible. Here's what <laughs> <laughs> uh, a true magician would never be a true magician if he didn't perform at least one card effect. Have exactly. we got a moment? Uh, we have Mr. Paul, our director. How much? About a minute. Yes. About a yes, minute. Sir. Perfect. Here's what I need you to do. I need you to take a card, look at it, and remember it. I'm mm. going to turn and then away. Put it back. Yes, please. Okay. Can I yep. show the audience? I'd, I'd prefer if you did. Not that I don't okay. trust you. Will you look away? And yeah. Make sure there's no I'll monitors look away. over. Fair? Don't look away. Okay. And yeah. We'll place the card back onto the pack and we'll place it fairly onto the table. Okay. Flattened. You don't know where it is. There's no possible way I could know where that is. I know a trick that involves me knowing where the tr the card is in the deck, but I have to hang on to it. You're not hanging on to I it. I am not touching that deck okay. at all. Look at me. Think of the card, the suit, the color, the value. Yeah. Yeah, I've got it. 
Is that amazing? 27. The number is 27. The card is 27 cards down in the deck. And I could count these out, but that would be a long time for your viewers. Believe me when I say that's 27, because that, my friend, is your card. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's incredible if you think about it. Here's what I need you to do. Say stop. Stop. Perfect. Place your card back onto the I pack. just looked at all the cards. They're not all King of Diamonds mm. or King of Spades mm. either. They're no, okay. they're not. Uh, but what's amazing about this is I can cuffle, shuffle and cut those cards in any position and cause your card to come right back to the very top. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, we're just at about uh, 20 seconds, but here's what we're going to do. We'll show you that your card is right there on top. No, we just saw four of spades. That's oh, you oh, no, it was just a four of spades. I saw spades. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, stay awesome. with us more with David Johnson after the break.